Guys, I've got terrible news. The balloons have stolen the engineer's blueprints, guys. And now the balloons have the balloon traps, except now they're monkey traps. So the balloons can now capture and trap the monkeys, guys. Can we still win in today's video? Let's find out. All right, guys, let's do this. I'm actually so excited to see how this works. So apparently, the way this works now is here. Where? Do, oh my gosh, I feel like this is a really good place to put. Oh my gosh, I bet a tax shooter goes really. I'm putting a tax shooter here, and nobody's gonna stop me. So if we start, you can see the balloons are actually. Let's see if he'll do it. They might not do it because he's getting too close. Let's see. Let's see if it'll happen. I'm ready. I'm ready to see it happen, guys. It's gonna trap them. Maybe these balloons are too weak. Maybe they need to be stronger balloons. Let's get faster shooting, even faster shooting. Let's go ahead. I don't want to upgrade this guy yet because I really want to see it happen. I want to see them, like, trap them. Of course, not every single balloon's gonna do it because then that would be very OP. Here, let's go ahead. Let's get triple shot, long range, enhanced eyesight, and then we can go ahead and get tax barrier on this guy as well. We need to make sure that we have both lanes of balloons, like, in pure defense. I don't know if they can actually get to this guy up here because he's, like, all the way up here. Let's get tax barrier because tax barrier, I love tax barrier. And it's actually such a good, this is a really good spot for it to be in. I guess we can put Benjamin, I guess we'll put Benjamin like over here. Benjamin's just gonna hide here. Luckily, none of the balloons have tried to capture our monkeys yet. So what I just learned is, and I was my mistake, is the balloons don't trap you until they become stronger balloons. So up until black balloons, the balloons will not trap you because otherwise that would be way too overpowered. So that's how they keep it a little bit more balanced and, e and fair. So that way, you know, you don't get absolutely destroyed. And when it captures the monkey, it doesn't permanently disable the monkey. It actually just kind of like puts glue on the monkey. And it like, it basically slows them down. And they have decreased range. And it makes them just way, way worse. And what's even worse, guys, is that Moabs put an even stronger barrier and capture the monkeys. Oh, there we go. Look, he was captured. Look at how much slower. Oh my gosh, look at his attack range. His attack range is so much worse. It literally halves his attack range. That's crazy. That makes it... Oh, my gosh. And so, apparently, the faster that the monkey attacks... Oh, my gosh, no. Balloons are starting to get by. I need a really fast... I think having a super monkey, like, right here is going to be really good. I, I like this right here. Having a super monkey here, because then we can push balloons back. Do I want knockback? Or do I want to go... Uh, do I want sun avatar? Tech terror? Or the Dark Knight. Because Dark Champion's too expensive. Let's get extra range, frag bombs, cluster bombs, bigger bombs, and heavy bombs. And that's going to be really nice just for that extra AoE. And it has a lot of extra range, too. Look at that. Look, he's missing every shot. Stop missing. Look at that. He literally misses. What a bunch of baloney, guys. Here, let's get laser blasts. And I also want to get plasma blasts as soon as we can as well. Because that's going to help us out. Oh, no. They they trapped our bomb shooter. That wasn't very nice. So it looks like it's a time thing. But if they attack fast enough, they're able to break out easier. Which I like that a lot. Once we stick, start getting stronger balloons much more regularly, I think it's going to basically end up just trapping all of our, all of our towers. And that's going to make it really difficult to play. Oh, no. There they go. Yeah, you can see it like rotates around. And then it stops them. I like that this guy has knockback because if he's pushing the balloons back all the time, it's not going to be as easy. Look, they trapped. How dare they trap my attack shooter? That wasn't very nice. I'm going to save it. Oh my gosh. Look at its range when it's trapped. It has like zero range. It actually won't. It's like melee, like super melee. Like it won't actually be able to pop anything. I can put a helicopter right there and then let's go ahead and get pursuit. And now that it's on pursuit, I don't think. Oh my gosh. Look, it uses the X. Look at his range. He's like a, he's literally like a tag shooter. His range is so bad. And Moab shove can collide. Yeah, let's get Moab shove because that way it's going to push the Moabs back and it's going to make it a lot easier for us to deal with. I'm going to go ahead and get radar scanner. And then I also want to get jungle drums. The reason I want to get jungle drums is just getting in a little bit of extra attack speed and it gives more attack speed to helicopter pilot. Kamachi defense. I kind of want to get that. I think that would be really nice to be able to have, but... I might consider getting uh, some other things as well. I want to get a Druid, and I'm going to put a Druid down here, and I just want to get Druid of the Jungle. What would happen if I just got a bunch of these, like the Druid of the Jungle, and it entangles and crush a, a balloon one at a time? If we had enough of these guys, do you think we could win? I wonder. That would be really funny. I want to try that out one day. We can go ahead. I'm actually going to go and get Kamashi Defense. 
because it's really nice to have that just in case we need it. In case, you know, something something happens, some of the balloons try to get by. Oh no, it trapped our monkey! Get our monkey out! No! That's so crazy that the balloons have this technology now. I don't like it. Oh wait, I've never I didn't even get recursive cluster. Now we have recursive cluster, and that's gonna help us out way more. I want to put an ice monkey down right here. And then I want to go ahead and get snowstorm, larger radius, and refreeze. There we go. That's actually such a bad, like, I probably shouldn't have had him there. But I don't think there's any, I guess, maybe down here? I don't really see any good spot to put a nice monkey. Look out, look! This thing just, like, doesn't shoot at all because the Moab, like, put the, look at this. Look at how slow it shoots. Oh, look at it, range! It literally can't shoot! Its range is so bad that once it's put on, it, it can't attack. When a Moab, look at that. It's literally, it takes it out of the game. And it can't even fire. That's so good. Yeah, look at this range. Oh my gosh. That makes it really difficult to have to deal with, honestly. Yeah, so far. Look at our Comanche defense. 24,000 pops. This guy's got 15,000. 43,000 pops on this guy. Wowee. Oh yeah, look. That's like permanently stuck. That's not going anywhere. Because it just, it pushes it back constantly. And I love that. That helps out so much. We need to go ahead and get the big one. Because the big one's just a really nice upgrade to have. There we go. I need a little bit. There we go. Now we got that one. Now, now it's, now we're doing, now we're big, strong guys, guys. Guys, do you think there's a secret with this alien ship? I wish there was. I wish there was more secrets and balloons. Like, there was more just, like, weird Easter eggs of things. Wait, what? You can remove these! I'm so silly! I can't. Guys, I just now realized I didn't know you could remove those. Oh my gosh, that makes this map way easier. That actually changes so much about this map. It really does. It might not seem like it does, but it do. I need one portable lava lake. And a destroyer ship is so good right here. Grape shot, hot shot, faster shooting, double shot, and destroyer. That's all I need. Oh my gosh, look at his range! Oh my gosh, his attack range is so bad. Let's get the aircraft carrier as well. Aircraft carrier is always really nice to get. Wait, does aircraft carrier change the... Wait, what? Oh my gosh, his attack range is always so bad. Because when the attack range gets half, you can't actually hit any balloons. So probably the best towers for this are sniper monkeys. Because they have infinite range anyway, so it doesn't matter. Mortar monkeys because they have infinite range anyway. Like any military tower is really good against this because they basically always have infinite range. Uh, plane helicopters are going to be really good because you, they're like you could put them way away from the track and they're still just going to chase down the balloons and be able to do stuff, right? So, like, I think that works out really well for us. Okay, this tower is not worth it, guys. I made a grave mistake. That definitely. And this tower, I should also sell it because it's not going to do anything, right? This ice tower. It's worth 5,000. Oh my gosh, why is there there's so many ceramic balloons? Okay, we dealt with them. It was, it was like lagging for a second, so it was like starting to be a little bit scary. Ooh, do I want to get the biggest one, guys? What do I want to get? No, let's just upgrade and get Comanche to Commander. Like, that's a really, really solid upgrade to get. It just helps out. And look at our boy Benjamin. Benjamin got us $20,000, guys. Like, my hair, guys, was looking really bad this morning. I had to go get adjusted, like, at a chiropractor. And I went in. And the first thing that happened is I looked at the receptionist and she did this thing where like she looked up at my hair and kinda like giggled and went back to her thing and I immediately I was like, my hair's probably really messed up. I, I pulled out my phone and looked at my picture and I go, Yep, my hair looked it was like guys, like my hair literally was like it was like it looked kinda like that guys. Like it was really bad. It was funny. <laughs> it cracked me up. Oh here we go, round 80, let's go! I'm ready here. Let's get the biggest one and we can set target so we can get a couple of pops. There we go. Easy, guys. Let's go. I hope you enjoyed today's video, guys. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being you. Thanks for being amazing. Making sure to drink some water today, guys. Go, go get hydrated. Be kind to other people. You never know what other people are going through. And most importantly, be kind to yourself, guys. Because, well, you're you and you're awesome. So have a great day and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.